Hey guys, Chainlink will also do some crazy st stuff this year. Grayscale Trust is coming and DTC. See? Also, what's your take on this? On Chainlink? I mean, Chainlink, people are using Chainlink a lot. Chainlink has so much composability with other DeFi protocols that it makes sense why Chainlink has blown up, right? If anything, I mean, I definitely regret selling all my Chainlink <laughs> because I was in, in the ICO after like a 5 or 10x. I was like, you know what? It's, it's down here, right? Because bear market was coming. They had zero marketing. But I mean, 4chan and the meme, the crypto meme scene or community just took Chainlink and ran with it. And I mean, it, now they have other people doing their marketing for them, right? But the issue with Chainlink is because our team was also looking into using Chainlink for token metrics. And we had a call with, with our development team. And I was speaking with my team in, in, internally. And you, you, you don't have to use Chainlink or the link token for Chainlink for an Oracle. And I was thinking, like, then what's the point of the token? <laughs> uh, not sure if I missed something. But uh, you can use Chainlink, their Oracles, without really using their Maybe I have to go back and see how they're actually using the token, but it didn't really seem to be that necessary in their token. Okay. All right. Uh, Bill, are you there? Hi, I'm here. Can you see me and hear me? Uh, yes. Yeah, we can see you. Okay. So I don't have screen share, so I'll have to talk to you about Chainlink. Our original target for chain link was 24 and everything Ian said about the token is correct. It's almost like with chain link, you're buying stock in the link Marines, right? And it's also <laughs> well, a part of the, it's also, it's also a component of these big DeFi indices. So I look at chain link as a leading indicator because one of the things you'll notice about this move is that link went first, right? Link was up like, you know, three, four, five days in a row, got all the way up to 24. And then ETH and this whole market is, is just gone. So, you know, it's almost like the Link Marines hit the beach first. You know, I think if the whole space moons, uh, chain link can go to 30, right? But there are probably plays in the market that can one to three X. And I think capital is probably better used elsewhere. Although again, the other thing about chain link is, is that the chain link rally may ignite rallies in other oracles or, or that space in general. So collect me if I'm wrong, maybe band protocol, UMA, you know, all of these related coins that back in August and September were mooning. The Federal Reserve has given you license to start DeFi 2.0. Okay. And it starts with ETH and it's going to move out into all these coins. And again, the ironic thing about it is, you know, Link starts it, ETH follows, and then eventually there'll be a polka dot trade. But this ETH move, uh, it's, it's going to be huge. It's going to be so huge that you're probably not going to be in more, in anything other than ETH, say Litecoin, Bitcoin cash and the DeFi space. Right. And then polka dot and the rest of it follows. And that probably includes chain link because I'm guessing chain link is somehow wound up with the dot trade. That just seems to be how it moves. Yeah. Oh man. Ethereum up 18% in one day. Holy moly. <laughs> Why does it pay to be an ETH maximalist right now? <laughs> Token Metrics is a cryptocurrency investment platform that helps users leverage machine learning to become better crypto investors. Our in-depth analysis helps eliminate the emotions of investing, find profitable investment opportunities, and filters out scams. Learn more at tokenmetrics.com.